Okay, hi, I'm Pascal Serranes and today I'm going to show you uh, my full body movements using the Razor Hydra, which enables me to move my hands of course, but also to lean forward, to kneel and to turn around. So normally you would use this setup in combination with the glasses like the Oculus Rift, but this, for this prototype demonstration I'm going to use just the Razor Hydra. I'm not using any buttons of the thing, I'm just using the position. So normally you would use it to move your arms like this, move your hands, you can even use the buttons for moving the fingers, but that's not the purpose. Um, because when I implemented the first implementation of the hands, I was quite limited in the things I could reach with my virtual body. And I wanted to reach more, so for example, I wanted to lean forward, because when there's something far away on the table, I can reach it further by bending my forward in this case. So the first implementation was to use the same inverse kinematics uh, technology as you, which is used for the hands and also for the body. In this case the torso is my upper, upper uh, arm and the stretched arm themselves act as the lower part of the arm. And you can use this exact same uh, technology for uh, doing this. Additionally, I also want to kneel down because when something is on the ground, you want to, re to be able to gra grab it from the ground down. So, uh, additionally, when my hands are below about 20 centimeters below my waist, I start bending the knees and the hips and the, and the feet in order to reach the ground in this case. Um, then the third thing was body rotation. And this I implemented because um, with the Oculus Rift on, you get quite nasty when you turn around using a thumbstick because your real body doesn't turn around and it makes you really nauseous uh, in that case. So I wanted to use the position of the Razer Hydra devices to determine which, one, which direction I'm looking at. So you can see in this simple setup, it is quite simple. But even when I just move one hand, normally you don't want to turn. And I found a way where you still can use one hand and don't move all directions uh, like, like this when you move your hands. It's just when both hands are in a certain direction, then the body will follow. And in, you, in the most cases it works. It's a bit glitchy, so maybe I will do some improvements on this, but in general it works very well. Actually the glitchiness is not a real problem when you have the uh, Oculus Rift on, because then you normally do not look often at your body. It's just when you are walking, for example, then it's important direction of your body. So um, this is basically it. I hope you find it interesting. If you do find it interesting, uh, I might bring it out in the asset store uh, of the Unity. So I, if you're interested, give me a note and uh, I will probably get some more effort in getting it into the asset store. So uh, thank you for the attention and see you.